The Lord be with you. I'm Deacon Keith Fournier, and our first reading is from the book of Joel. Priest, put on sackcloth and lament. You ministers of the altar, wail. Come here, lie in sackcloth all night long, you ministers of my God, for the temple of your God has been deprived of cereal offering and libation. Order a fast, proclaim a solemn assembly. You elders, summon everybody in the country to the temple of Yahweh your God. Cry out to Yahweh, alas for the day, for the day of Yahweh is near coming as destruction from Shaddai. Blow the ram's horn in Zion, sound the alarm on my holy mountain. Let everybody in the country tremble, for the day of Yahweh is coming, yes it is near. Day of darkness and gloom, day of cloud and blackness. Like the dawn across the mountains spreads a vast and mighty people, such as has never been before, such as will never be again to the remotest ages. And our psalm is taken from Psalm 9. I rejoice and delight in you. I sing to your name, Most High. My enemies are in retreat. They stumble and perish at your presence. The enemy is wiped out, mere ruins forever. You have annihilated their cities. Their memory has perished. See, Yahweh has made himself known, given judgment. He has ensnared the wicked in the work of their own hands. Muted music. He will himself judge the world in uprightness. He will give a true verdict on the nations. May Yahweh be a stronghold for the oppressed, a stronghold in times of trouble. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to St. Luke. But some of them said, it is through Beelzebul, the prince of devils, that he drives devils out. Others asked him as a test for a sign from heaven. But knowing what they were thinking, Jesus said to them, any kingdom which is divided against itself is heading for ruin and house collapses against house. So too with Satan. If he is divided against himself, how can his kingdom last? Since you claim that it is through Beelzebul that I drive devils out. Now if it is through Beelzebul that I drive devils out, to whom do your own sons drive them out? They shall be your judges then. But if it is through the finger of God that I drive devils out, then the kingdom of God has indeed caught you unawares. So long as a strong man fully armed guards his own home, his goods are undisturbed. But when someone stronger than himself attacks and defeats him, the stronger man takes away all the weapons he relied on and shares out his spoil. Anyone who is not with me is against me, and anyone who does not gather in with me throws away. When an unclean spirit goes out of someone, it wanders through waterless country looking for a place to rest. And not finding one, it says, I will go back to the home I came from. But on arrival, finding it swept and tidied, it then goes off and brings seven other spirits more wicked than itself. And they go in and set up house there. And so that person ends up worse off than before. The Gospel of the Lord.